the coin metaphor. That's the one I use because, uh, man, being a nurse and the almost constant pressure to uh, document, to really uh, have some kind of uh, all the T's are crossed, all the I's are dotted, uh, ever, every organization I've worked for, <coughs> even not as a hospice nurse, other organizations, um, really rely on documentation. Uh, the Department of Health is coming, JACO's coming. Uh, it's just the documents need to be in order. But then, lo and behold, there's an actual patient, an actual person, and in terms of hospice, is dying. I mean, they need the help that they need. And I find the contact with the patient is so profound, it's so moving, it's so, I have to really be present and I cannot be really what I call in service to the patient. I really can't be with them on their journey until I let go of all the things that have come before that visit and anything that's gonna be coming after, which includes the documentation. So at some point, of course, I pick up my computer, I'm checking their medications, I'm looking through uh, the notes I have from the last visit, was there something I forgot to ask them about? At some point I go into kind of more of a mixed mode. Uh, but when I first walk in and I sit down, I want to be totally with that patient. What the coin means to me is a coin is something that has two sides. It has two sides clearly, uh, and yet it's one thing. Uh, this one thing is being a hospice nurse. It includes tales, uh, documentation, and keeping notes, and but the heads is um, the patient. And clearly when the patient is up, tails are down. I don't see that side of things. I see the patient side of things. When I walk out, uh, I'm making some notes after the visit. Um, then the tail side is up and I'm doing my documentation. So the whole coin to me is being a hospice nurse, but having this image of a coin allows me as I'm right outside the door, I'm about to go in, I make sure that that coin, the heads is up, that I'm about to see the patient and I'm not thinking about what the particular needs of the documentation are. I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna be present for that patient that time.